Valentine's Day was fast approaching on the island of Sodor, and the few female engines were excited. They had gathered at the sheds to gossip about their respective Valentines. Henry is going to be my Valentine, boasted Emily. Ha, he's a total idiot, retorted Mavis, quite unnecessarily. Like you can talk, Diesel is your Valentine. They don't call him Devious Diesel for nothing. He's a real bad boy. My Valentine is... Uh... I can't remember his name, said Molly, whose brain was as blonde as her paintwork. What does he look like? Uh, he's a tender engine, and he's silver, and, uh... Spencer, gasped Mavis, who couldn't believe that an engine with as much class as Spencer would have an engine as dim-witted as Molly for his valentine. You're going with Spencer? Yeah, that's his name. How is that even possible? I guess men do like blondes. Yeah, he's really nice. Who's your valentine, Rosie? Uh, I don't believe in Valentine's Day. It's too commercialized, in my opinion, replied Rosie, as all single engines do. What other rubbish? snapped Emily. You've got to have a valentine, Rosie, said Mavis encouragingly. I don't, I don't know, guys. I think love should be and can be celebrated every day of the year, without needing to spend money at all said Rosie, now clearly turning into some kind of Tumblr hipster that has never really known love but is still keen to comment on it nonetheless. What? That's ridiculous. Don't worry, Rosie. There are way more male engines on the island than female ones. You should be able to get a valentine easy as. You... you think? Of course! For sure! Hmm... Maybe I'll go ask a few engines later then. No time! Valentine's Day is tomorrow, and you've got to give him time to get you something. Um, okay then. I'll talk to you later, guys, said Rosie, and she puffed away. Good luck. She'll need it. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, Thomas the Tank Engine was enjoying a well-earned washdown at the engine wash. Ah, the engine wash. The one place where an engine can truly be at peace with the world. To think and ponder about the mysteries of the railway and... Hey, Thomas! Good God, what are you doing? I just wanted to talk to you. Can it wait? Not really. But I'm in the engine wash. I know. Anyway, I was just wondering if you wanted to be my valentine. Rosie, go away! Hey, Percy, do you want to be my valentine? Uh, I I'm sorry, Rosie. Edward already asked me, and, uh, I kind of said yes. Oh. Uh, oh, okay, then. That's, uh, that's cool. And somewhat weird. All right. Sir, sir. Topham, did you remember to put the table at the restaurant? Yes, woman, I've done it already. Oh, hello, Rosie. How can I help you? I was just wondering if perhaps you'd like to be my valentine. Oh, that sounds wonderful, Rosie, but uh, unfortunately, my valentine is... Uh, my wife. Topham, did you remember to clean out Garfield's litter box? Yes, woman, I've done it. Now stop nagging me already. Hey, Oliver. Do you want to be my valentine? I wish I could be, but Toad is going to be my valentine. Oh, it's going to be so romantic, Mr. Oliver. Oh my god, Toad, you're so annoying! Hey, Toby, do you want to be my valentine? Well, sorry, Rosie. Henrietta is my valentine. Gordon, do you want to be my... No. Hey, Slender Engine, do you want to be my valentine? Oh, I guess I'll never find a valentine. Forever alone. Is this sugar-free chocolate? Of course, Topham dear. You really need to watch your weight. I-I know, woman! Stop bloody nagging me!